So this is Cyanus Harbor. This is where we're going to be taking off from. Sun's just starting to come out. It's supposed to be 74 degrees today. It's supposed to be a gorgeous day after that little rain this morning. And uh, yeah, it's going to be a great day. So here we have the black cat and we're coming up on the very parking lot and uh we're not parking here today we got a private spot but uh how much is the parking uh it's 30 dollars 30 dollars for the day it's per calendar day yeah. okay thanks this is the high line is this the high line parking parking how much is it for the day $30. Okay, nice. Okay, we'll be back. Thank you. This is Bismore Park. This is where all the boats. Oh, look, the ferries, the big ferries leaving. This is the ferry that carries cars. And this is the uh, steamship ferry. And so they're heading out to Nantucket, the same place we're going. But we're going on the fast ferry, uh, which takes one hour versus two hours on the big boat. There she goes. These are all your fishing boats, scallopers. Um, let me see, yeah, these are draggers. They have all the winches in the back. But we're heading right over here to the High Line and we're gonna take this over to Nantucket. You catch anything down there? Nothing, it's been rough. It's been rough? Yeah, there's a lot of, you can see down here, there's a lot of bait and the snappers are eating them. Right yeah. here, you can see the shimmering over there. It's all fish, eating the little fish. Well, good luck to you, I hope you catch something. Thanks, have a good day. You can always go to the fish market like I do. Yeah, and uh, fish market is just farm, <laughs> fish is farm. They use like different uh, chemicals, like uh, I can't remember any of the names that they use, different things to, to, to keep the fish fresh. Yeah. If I catch my own fish, it's fresh. Child, yeah. It's, you know, it's fresh. You're a smart man. So we're taking the uh, Highline Ferry this morning, and it's like forty-five dollars per person, and the steamship's a little bit less. But uh, this is this works out better for us because of the time frame. Uh, we want to get there for 10:30, and uh, so yeah, like I said, it takes about one hour. And the, on the fast ferry, you know, normally in the old days I'd take my own boat over, and uh, it just cost me like twenty dollars in gas. But uh, I got to get another boat. For now, we'll we'll use the Steamship Authority and the High Line. So this is the High Line ticket office. We'll go inside and make sure our tickets are valid. So we're all set. We already got our tickets and it's on our phone. So, all right, let's go get on board. Dock two. That's Baxter's, that's where you can get fried clams and have a nice dinner. And the big tall building, that's Cape Cod Hospital. Right on the harbor, so if you happen to be in the hospital, you have an ocean view, it's pretty cool. Here we go. Over the Nantucket. There's a seal. The guy that used to own that house uh, owned Reebok, the shoe company. So just to tell you a little bit about Nantucket, it's located about 30 miles 
south of mainland Cape Cod. And oftentimes it's referred to as the Great Lady because it's oftentimes shrouded in fog. And it's just a great island. It's really another playground for the rich and famous. You have Martha's Vineyard, you have Newport, Long Island, Block Island, just all these great places. Nantucket's another one. And um, yeah, it's, this is, has a lot of history there. They have, um, uh, this is where back in the day, whales were caught and harvested there. And this is where they took and made scrimshaw carvings like boards and things like that and jewelry. And so it's, it's, a, it's a kind of a really unique island. And so we're gonna be there in a, about one hour. Off in the distance, you see that white cluster of homes? Well, that's the Kennedy compound. And it's not that many of them living there anymore, but at one time, that was the place. Coffee too, Anna? Yes. Okay. Here we are in Nantucket. And there's the branch. Point Lighthouse. Very beautiful. Here's my family. Hey. Hi. Looking all dressed up. Hey, how are you? Look at you checking a video. <laughs> I love you. I love you too. Oh, oh hi. Hi, Jack. Yeah. <laughs> mm. yeah. I love you. Welcome um, to Nantucket. Yeah. So, yeah. Yeah, fun, huh? Hello. <laughs> so I just want to show you my new shirt that I just bought. See? Nantucket, isn't that great? Matching you guys? Oh, there's a lot of people. Where the flowers are just beautiful. I have my new Nantucket sweatshirt. You like it? I just think truck around and splash. <laughs> so, one of the things about Nantucket is there's a lot of history about whaling. This is where it all started back in between the mid 1700s up to 1830. If you recall, Herman Melville wrote this great book about Moby Dick, about chasing the sperm whale. And this is a good example of a sperm whale. And the reason why they used to whale out of Nantucket is because there's 
closer to the deeper waters where the whales used to swim. And so this is what Nantucket's all about. It was the whaling capital of the world. And everything in Nantucket's all about whales. And if I could just show you this beautiful pocketbook. Come on. Whales. Everything is about whales, you see? Yeah. It's a big retail market for whales. That's right. And people come over here and they buy expensive scrimshaw because ivy was sought after, as well as the oil, the precious oil that used to come from the sperm whales. They used to let, use it to light lanterns and cook with. So it's very, very, it's a very important part of Nantucket's history. Now this is typical, this is Main Street High. Um, so this is typical of Nantucket, the cobblestone streets. And these date back to the 1700s. And um, yeah, this is the main corridor here. It goes up a hill. And you got the Jarrett Coffin House up there, nice restaurant. And this is where all the uh, festivities occur, right here in the center. And uh, there's a lot of fine shopping here, which we're doing right now. We're just doing a lot of browsing. And, uh, but it's a very, very quaint, historic fishing village here on Nantucket. A nice little fall basket here in the center of town as we look up Main Street. Look at that with the pumpkins. Very beautiful. All ready for the beach. Look at that car, huh? Nice little BMW. And a lot of the stores here are pretty high end. This is uh, Ralph Lorenda designer. Go and check this out. Yeah, nice stuff. He has lots of nice colors for sure. Ralph Lauren. I know, I love Ralph Lauren. He's my favorite designer. Totally beautiful with the hydrangeas, the white hydrangeas, which are very popular here on the island. Cisco, Cisco, Cisco Beach. Cisco oh. Beach. Big surfing, big surfing beach. Talk, yeah. Cisco Beach. Cisco. Oh, they have a Cisco brewery out here, too, right. I think. Too. And you can also have a red bike Woo! if you want to ride around these lumpy cobblestone streets. There, it's a sure thing. Nice name. A little woody. Nice. Oh, beautiful artwork, look at this. That's what I'm talking about. This is where a lot of the fashion comes from here on the uh, on the island, right here on Main Street, Nantucket. And that's looking down towards the harbor. You get a really good feel for that cobblestone street. Look at that. Not too many of those left in the country. Okay, we switched sides of the street. Now we're heading up towards the Jarrett Coffin House, towards the top of the hill. Beautiful flower boxes. Lemon press.
Oh, an old time pharmacy. Look at this. Wow. Just like in the old days, huh? I saw these ducks over in Chatham. How funny. Look at the whales. So this is the scrimshaw that they used to gather from the whale's bones and teeth and tusks. They make these beautiful carvings and uh, well sought after. You know, these are thousands of dollars. Look at this. Boats, lighthouses. Very nice. And this is one, this is an, a carving, it's a ship, it's made out of ivy. Incredible. This is kind of what they used to go after the whales in, and then they'd send off these little boats, hang them over the side, and they'd chase the whales around. But this was like the mothership. It's a blazer that somebody cut the top off. Wow. You think? Yeah. Nice. For the beach. Let's go to the beach. Can you bring your bathing suits? Yeah. Beautiful architecture. Look at these homes. And keep in mind, right now we're only in town. You know, we haven't really gone over the island. There's so much to see, but this is just one little piece of Nantucket. So now we're at the Whaling Museum and you can go in here and you can learn all about the history of whaling. So I guess we're not going into the Whaling Museum because it's not open today. So we'll go check out something else. Monday through Saturday. But you see a lot of the Greek revival architecture here because of the money that came into the town from the whaling industry. Oh, okay. Looks like an old church, but it's a. Uh... Oh, it's one of the beautiful columns, Antonium. So real estate's not too cheap here. It's 15 million, 5 million, 15 million, 6 million, 3 million, 4 million. Anything for 300,000? I don't think so. 13 million. Wow walking on cobblestones with their high heels. <laughs> How is it, Anna? I was walking on cobblestones, honey. <laughs> oh, that's your car? Yeah, oh my goodness. So this is our rig. This is our beach mobile. Nice. So this is our house where we're staying. This is our vehicle. And um, yeah, it's nice. Oh, beautiful. The garden, look. Yeah. Oh, yeah. It's got like a little koi pond, huh? Yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, look at them all. Look at that. Oh my god, see the frog? I saw it. All the little um, jars light up. It's beautiful. Yeah. Oh, you got a sucker in it. looks like a, a sucker. Look at him. A bunch of koi fish. There's a, a black and white one coming. Look at this one. Isn't that cool? Goldfish. That's what we used to call them. 
is our home. It's our place. Oh, Very nice. Got a little galley kitchen in here. You go out and sit in the hammock. Are you um, going to make your percolated coffee, Jackie? Uh, I don't know. Do you guys want coffee? Do you want a Bloody Mary? Do you want um, um, a glass of wine? Do you want a beer? Do you want, what do you want? All the above. A soda? Above. Uh, coffee. Huh? From Hawaiian side? No. Yeah, yeah. Here's the master bedroom. Looks right out this beautiful view into the woods. So right now we just arrived at Millie's out here in Mattakit, Nantucket, which is the west end of the island. So we're gonna go in here and have some lunch. And everything is spe on special today because they're end of the season. This is Mattica Beach, the west end of the island, right near Millie's, where we just had a wonderful lunch. So right now, we're at Jetty's, and we're gonna go have a few cocktails here on the beach and listen to a live band. End of the summer. End of the summer parties. Cool. Look at this guy, huh? Now we're going to Cisco Brewers out here in Nantucket. This is where everybody goes to drink really good beer. So let's check this out. There's a sign we're getting close. Oh, the kegs. Oh, look. That's where they make the beer, huh? Look at that, huh? 
found the source. So here at Cisco, you have to show your COVID passport and positive uh, negative test. And you can get in, you can get a little band like that. So now we're gonna go flannel jam. Ah, whatever that is. But this is Cisco Brewers right here. This is where the famous beer is made. We got our beer, we got a nice gluten-free organic beer, and we're not gonna, we're probably not gonna die. Whoop. You okay, honey? Yeah. Ah, we just had an accident. Beer spilled all over the parking lot. Catch the sunset here in Nantucket at the beach. So we're all running to catch this gorgeous end of the day. Oh, here we go. Into the dune buggy, a Chevy dune buggy. All right. Come on, Anna. Come on. Come on, Anna. Anna can sit on your left. Anna Banana. Let's go. No, she can sit right in it. She's all a 98 pounds. She's a big girl. Get the middle. I'm good. Okay. 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 All right. You guys are demanding. <laughs> you have a yeah. nice right. demand. You have a lot of room, huh? <laughs> there is still a lot of room. Yeah. All right. We're going to catch this sunset here in Nantucket to end the perfect day. Oh, don't hit my baby. Is that yours? That's my baby. Okay. Yeah. Oh. I'm going to hit that. <laughs> <laughs> Imagine if she bumped it and I was like, 
lost her hat. We're gonna see the sunset. Oh, I don't know what we're gonna do. Everybody's drunk and happy. We got the sun over here, getting ready to set. And another beautiful day. There it goes. Thank you, Nantucket, for a wonderful day. We did it. What a great day. here in Nantucket and I look forward to seeing you on our next adventure. Christine has the cash cap dashboard. <laughs> <laughs> oh look at it, see? Cash cap. Alright folks, you have to answer six questions. You're okay, probably going to get them all wrong. Oh, <laughs> there we go. No, this is the cat. Christine's going all day. Christine. Christine's not something. That's not us. We're, we're going to Barbara Farm. Are we now? We're in the cash cabin. Oh, On the streets. So I guess we're going back on the High Line. Uh, just barely made it. Wow, so beautiful. You want to go up? Mm -hmm. Yeah, but you know, in another couple of weeks, so it gets really quiet. Oh. So keep that in mind. Yeah.